Welcome back to our New York vlogs. <laughs> we are in a vegan bakery, which is so exciting. So we're getting a BEC, which is like bacon, egg, cheese in a croissant. We've got this mahoosive, mahoosive cinnamon bun, cinnamon swirl, and two coconut lattes. And we're gonna have to sell our gap to pay for the bill, which is true. <laughs> Never have we ever seen anything like this in my life. <laughs> Look at that just egg. There's bacon under there. Cheese is in it. It's huge. Imagine getting across on that size at home. Oh, delicious. <laughs> oh my God. That's so fucking good. The egg, the cheese, the bacon, the croissant. Wow. Okay, we're gonna try this cinnamon swirl. Eva's already had it. Said it's so real and juicy. Oh my god. Nope. Nope. <laughs> that is unbelievable. Well, that food was delicious. 10 out of 10. Yeah. Would recommend to friends. Yeah, so, so, so good. So we're going to Domino Park, which is only like a six minute walk from where we are. And the lad, one of the lads on the desk where we're staying, oh, vintage shop, recommended it to us. So we're gonna go check that out. Holy fuck. Holy cow. We have arrived at Domino Park. That is some view. I wanna hold her. Wow, that is stunning. We could sunbathe. Should we go for a little dip? Yeah. <laughs> wow. That's so nice. Okay, well there's another landmark we could check off the list, Evie. My God. Ticking all the boxes, so yeah. We are hitting them places hard. What's up, Bridge? Williamsburg. Williamsburg. Oh, we're just having a nice little strolly along this promenade. No, it's not a promenade, I don't know what it is, but we're walking along. So we have a tour this evening where we're starting in Manhattan and we're doing Diker Heights. Yeah. Can't fucking wait to show you that, lads. Can't wait to see it myself. My God. And then... Goes to Dumbo. Dumbo. Another one to check off the list. Yeah. And then, don't know what else it does, but it's about four hours, so I'm very much looking forward to it. And we get pizza, and there's a vegan pizza slice there. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. We may or may not have come into a vintage shop. Buffalo Exchange, ladies and gentlemen. All the Christmas jumpers. hotel room. It's about 20 past one. Got ourselves a little iced coffee with coconut milk. I don't mind if I do. Very close to where we are. It was actually a really cute little coffee place. Delicious. Anyways, you would have seen we are in Brooklyn Exchange. No. Buffalo. Buffalo Exchange. Bought a few purchases. They're mainly Christmassy clothes, which obviously means that I can only wear them like November, December-ish time. But I love them and if you were to get something like that at home, it would be like double the price. Mm -hmm. Maybe even more. Yeah, actually some of them could be even more. Anyways, let's get straight into it. Scooby-Dooby-Doo, where are you? It's Scooby-Doo Christmas themed 
you have all the gang there, you have the mystery van and they've got a Christmas tree on top of the mystery van and it's red and it's large and Amazing. I, yeah, it's so nice, it was only $14, one, four. Now, that is probably expensive for America, but for at ho like for us? No. No, you wouldn't get that for like 28 euro. No. No, it would be in the 30s at least. So, very excited about that. <laughs> I think it'd be really nice if I had like my, my black one of these on or even a white one underneath it. Gorgeous, we love it. Then, I got this little goona. That's a goona! And it makes a little jingle jingle, which is definitely gonna get annoying for everyone else around me, but for me it won't be. $15.50. and $15.50 pence, whatever they use. Cents. Cents. And it's a little goona, little goona. So I'm gonna wear that for when I go for drinks with my cousins. And I love it. And it looks good on me. So that's the main thing. The family The family Then, this is just incredible. I love it so much. So if you've been following me and you've seen my, uh, some of my Halloween content or, what was it? Yeah, I got it before yeah. I went to Tokyo. And I wore it in a lot of my Tokyo vlogs. Or at least one or two. I'm not sure. But you would have seen that I got a Halloween cardigan. Well, I found a Christmas cardigan. <laughs> and it's like, I don't know, it's, it's giving similar vibes. Yeah, real, like, Isn't it? retro. Yeah, very retro. So, this is what it looks like. Now, it is a large, but so is my Halloween one. And the Halloween one was so nice on. Hall yes! So nice on. So we've got all our Christmas bubbles and Christmas lights. So cool. You got like little beads there, they're 3D. Little stitching, red buttons. Ugh. And then the the outline or the hem, you might say. Red, stunning, we love it. Okay, lastly, I got this mainly for festivals it's and it has, yeah, it's so cute. It has all aliens, spaceships, stars, etc, etc, and I think it'll just look so cute. Twelve dollars. And if it's like I love, so <laughs> delighted I got that. But yeah, that shop was definitely cheaper than I expected it to be, because vintage shopping in New York, it's, it's not going to be cheap, do you know what I mean? Especially when you compare it to like the southern states, not that I've been there, but just from watching videos online. But I was very happy with the prices of these. So, we love to see it! So yeah, we're just gonna chill here, I think, for a bit, and then mosey for our bus tour. Flingy my bob, this bu afternoon. Bu 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 bus tour. Bu 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 bus tour. I don't know if that was a Taylor Swift song. First stop. We're off the bus. Whoa. Oh my god, is that someone's house? No. Yeah. Oh my god. No, can't.
so much footage. Hmm. Okay. All on my phone though. Yeah. Mic drop number two. Remember, I said there were two. On the way to Dome. So sad, sad, Jen. We're back off the bus. We're in Dumbo. We're at a pizza place. Front Street Pizza. Front Street Pizza. Which they do have vegan cheese, but they don't have it like by there. the slice. Yeah, by the slice. You have to get like the full pizza. But they did make us individual slices, which was so nice. No, they did have to take. <laughs> they had a margarita made, so they took the cheese off that, like the real cheese. And they took the sauce off it and put fresh sauce on it and then vegan cheese. <laughs> which was just... That, oh, thank you so much! <laughs> it was so cute though. We were like, yeah, that's absolutely perfect. Is it roasting? No, it's okay. Okay. Nice roast. Sorry, look at the size of that. Nice. Mm. Tomato-y. So cool. So we have a viewing point. So... I presume that's Dumbo Bridge. Oh, Manhattan Bridge. Yeah, down, oh, Manhattan Bridge. down under Manhattan Bridge. How could I forget? Oh, yeah. And if you look through that little arch, that's the Empire State Building. There she is. There she is in all her glory. Get a better view here. So stunning. Obviously not coming up very well. Oh, I thought someone fell there. In the camera, but you get the picture. You get the picture. This is incredible. These views, oh, so nice. And another viewpoint, slightly closer <laughs> to the water. Right there. The lights are so stunning. We've got one bridge. We've got two bridge. And we've got another one out there. There's another one just past a pillar thing. <laughs> We're back in the hotel room. It's probably like 10 o'clock. Ah, 10 past 10. I'm eating my $6 pack of crisps. Saying to Eve, these better last me to the end of December. Paying that price. It won it last year. So, the tour thing that we did, so fucking good. I really, 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 really recommend it. I will leave the company that we booked with linked below in like the description. So, if you're coming to New York and you want to do like Diker Heights and stuff, definitely do this tour. And like, like the tour in total was, I think we started at four, we got back at like, just before half eight. So like it's four and a half hours. But like when you're driving between places, you are getting like loads of information around or about the different landmarks that you're going by. And the girl that were like our tour guide, she was so nice. And she was just so knowledgeable on New York. It was incredible. Like she fucking knew everything. So highly recommend it. And like Diker Heights is just insane like obsessed some people are either like oh my god 10 out of 10 on like the best thing ever and then some people are like a little bit let down because they expect like every gaff to be lit up which it isn't but like still like the gaffs that are lit up are just insane and it's mad to think like so many houses in that area do it and so many people from around the world come and visit it it's just wild oh my pajamas are the same color as the wallpaper or the paint. <laughs> I'm mad. I don't know. So, yeah, and then seeing Dumbo at night and like the Empire State Building through the bridge. So cool. All the lights at night. Unreal. And then, yeah, we just walked back through Times Square, went to Sephora because I wanted to get the advent calendar, which I know I'm late, but apparently they sold out really quickly so they didn't have any. Did a little bit of, well, we went into Forever 21. They have such nice stuff in there. I'm actually raging that that's not in Ireland anymore. They have such nice things, but didn't get anything. Cause I suppose I didn't need anything in there. And then we just came out. Oh, that's different than I, having some crisps and just chilling the fuck out. 
up.